Plus, food fight. The customer chaos inside a Lower East Side restaurant you won't believe what workers say sent them into a fury. Good evening. Thank you for joining us at 6. I'm Natalie Pascarella. And I'm Chuck Scarborough. Workers say they are terrified to return to that Manhattan fry shop after rowdy customers attacked them over the price of sauce. Yeah, you heard that right. The wild scene unfolding right around 4 in the morning Sunday at the Bell Fries on the Lower East Side. You see the customers there, three of them hurl the glass bottles, a stool and other items at the employees. Two of those employees were hurt. News Force Mark Santia live outside the restaurant with the rest of this story, Mark. Natalie and Chuck, Bell Fries has been closed since the attack. The co-owner telling us he has six employees. They're all scared to come back to work because they're traumatized and scared for their lives. <laughs> Chaos inside Bell Fries. You're hearing the store alarm wail. Employees paralyzed by fear after they say these customers became enraged and violent when they were told there's a charge for extra dipping sauce for the French fries. They want an extra sauce. They don't want to pay for it. The extra sauce is actually a buck twenty-five, buck seventy-five, and you know, this started from them. The minute they told them, "Hey, you, got, you have to leave," once they say we have to leave, uh, they jumped on them. Twenty to thirty bottles broken. Uh, Thrown at microwaves, computers broken, the store <laughs> disaster when I went there. Uh, everything is a mess. This woman throws what looks like a can at employees, then others climb over the counter. They whip bottles of sauce at employees, a stool gets thrown, they rip down the pandemic plastic barrier bolted to the marble, but it's not over. They heave metal objects and destroy computers, laughing and clapping. The restaurant is torn apart as a group watches, recording on their phones. Exclusive new video shows employees trying to take cover during the attack. Four days later, and employees want no part of coming back here. Six employees we have, we all make a living through that store. We're talking, they, they have no other jobs. They say they're devastated, they're afraid, they can't. Um, and one of them still doesn't want, doesn't want to leave her home, don't want to get hit. Uh, she has a son, she fears her life. This small business co-owner spoke to us on the phone. He did not want his face shown or give his name, but he did want his message heard. He says Bell Fries here on Ludlow Street, open right before the pandemic, endured and served the community throughout COVID. They were just getting back on their feet when this happened. He rushed to help to find his store wrecked, then visited his injured employees in the hospital. Now he wonders what's next. I'm thinking again, is it worth it? Is it worth to do anything in New York City anymore? Three women were arrested. They're all facing several charges tomorrow. They're set to stand before a judge. We're live on the Lower East Side. I'm Mark Santia, News 4 New York.